Hey everyone, so today I have a second video for you. As promised, if you saw my vlog today, you saw that I had a giveaway and it looks like this and I'll go over that in just one second. This is to kick off my new lifestyle changes and going animal friendly and things like that, kind of to get you guys excited about some of the changes. And I know that everybody can't follow along in my footsteps or they might want to or they can't afford to and things like that and I get that. But I wanted to give you guys a little something to kind of get you excited and to know that some of the best companies are actually animal and pet friendly. So I will go over the prize in a second, but it will go from today, July 16th, Monday, until Thursday night, July 19th. And I will do the cutoff probably around 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I will put all that down below. So this makeup bag, and then inside of it, I have some little goodies for you guys. And these goodies, like I said, are all from companies that do not test on animals and things like that. Now, um, the first thing is the pink with a splash of Fresh and Clean. And this is all over body mist. This is from Victoria's Secret. It smells super good. I got like a tiny little size because in case somebody gets it and they like the fragrance, but they're not like, it's not their favorite favorite. So I thought I would get a little size for you guys to try out. The next thing is the Moroccan Oil um, Hair Treatment. And this is for all hair types. It's alcohol free and it's also got the um, recycle symbol and the bunny symbol on the back. And this is great if you apply it to your hair uh, wet or dry. If it's towel dried, you put a little bit in your hair and then you blow dry it and style it as regular and it helps with um, frizziness, helps with flyaways, it's great for um, heat protection and things like that and then you can also put it in when your hair is dry. So that's great and it smells good too. The next thing is a Bath & Body Works pocket back and I got it for you guys in lemon. And I did lemon because it's a nice summery fresh fragrance and I wasn't really sure if everybody liked the fruity fragrances because I'm not a huge fruity person. So I got lemon because I thought it was pretty neutral. The next thing is by a company um, called Kiki Pure and Simple and they are an organic company and I actually um, got this when I was a member of Eco Emmy and um, it was one of the samples that I got that's brand new and because I never used it because it was tinted and I am a little bit nervous about tinted lip balms but I thought I would pass this along because it's all natural, it's organic, it's 100% organic ingredients, gluten free, no nanoparticles, natural minerals, it's made in the USA, it's still 100% sealed, it's so cute, it's like this really pretty like chocolatey brownish reddish color and it's called Ooh La La Lip Shimmer and so I'm going to pass that along. The next thing is by a company um, called Earth Beauty and it's called Sunlight Mineral Colors and this is an eyeshadow or an eyeshadow in sunlight and it looks like this. It's this really pretty golden color and it's still sealed obviously, brand new. So it's a mineral eyeshadow for you guys to take a look at what mineral eyeshadows are out there that are from other companies other than Bare Essentials. I feel like I always cram bare essentials down everybody's throat and I don't mean to. Okay, and the next two products are from Burt's Bees and although Burt's Bees parent company is um, with animal testing, Burt's Bees is against animal testing. Um, so I thought, you know, this and of course this was before I did a little more research and found out, but um, I got these two products and I do like Burt's Bees stuff and someone actually told me this when I was going into this whole journey and they were like, you know, if you support Burt's Bees more than you support their parent company. Burt's, they're going to realize that Burt's Bees and the natural and the all, you know, the organic and all that kind of stuff is the way that people want to go without the animal testing and then the, the parent company might do the same thing. So it's a good thought, um, but I love this stuff. It's the Lemon Butter Cuticle Cream by Burt's Bees and it's still, it's brand new. Got this for you guys. It's sealed. And then I also got you guys the Burt's Bees Beeswax and Banana Hand Cream. This stuff is amazing and it's, it smells, it smells really good. It's got like a natural smell to it with a hint of banana and it's a brand new um, hand cream. And that's a travel size. And the last item that I got for you guys is one of my favorite items and I know that they're not American but they're an Austrian brand and they're called More M-O-R Cosmetics and they make these wonderful things called um, um, Lip Lip delight macaroons okay and they look like this they come in these really pretty little tins I'm sorry I think the plastics like making a glare on it but they're these really pretty lip tins and they come in all different uh, flavors and this one is actually in apples 
And it's a sweet lip delight that adds luster and the sheerest of sheens, packed full of moisture and a collectible kaleidoscope of colors. And again, um, this product is not tested on animals. More is a, um, a company that doesn't believe in animal testing. It's an Austrian brand. It smells amazing. And I think it reminds me of like an apple teeny taste. So I got you guys one of these. I carry one of these around in my purse all the time and love these. So those are the products you're going to get in this cute little bag. And I will send this to one winner. And it's so simple. Be a subscriber and just leave me one comment down below. And I'm asking the comment to be, what is one thing, I know that all of you can't, you know, change your entire lifestyle or you might not want to change your lifestyle, but what is one thing that you feel you can do to contribute to this lifestyle change? Whether it be you use a shampoo that is from a company that tests on animals and you're going to change it to something that doesn't test on animals. Just leave me a comment below of one thing that you would change in your lifestyle to help against animal testing. And um, I would love it because it gives me inspiration to continue to do this and it also gives me new ideas. So I thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.